What's happening guys? My name is Crazy Single and we are back again for the next episode of our Pokemon Sun Let's Play. And if you guys are not yet caught up, be sure to check the description for a link to the playlist. Get all caught up so there's no spoilers today. Uh, also be sure to smash those thumbs up down below and let's get into this episode. Let us get a quick party recap before we get going. We have our Mimikyu level 58, Rock and Shadow, Sneak Sword, Sands, Play Rough, and Leech Life. We have Kakamo O. Hakamo O, level 43, uh, the Sky Uppercut, Dragon Claw, Work Up and Protect. Uh, I decided to add him to the party so he can get grinded up, get evolved, uh, so we can be able to use a Como O on our party. We have Feminist level 56 with Dragon Pulse, uh, Flamethrower, Sludge Bomb, and Toxic. We have Decidueye level 55 with Brave Bird, Leech, uh, Leaf Blade, not Leech Life, that doesn't say Leech Life. Uh, U-Turn and Spirit Shack. We have Premier level 57 with Hyper Voice, uh, Sparkling Aria, Scald, and Moonblast. Then we have Toucan level 57 with Roost, Drill Peck, Beak Blast, and Bullet Seed. And uh, as you guys know, in the last episode, um, some absolutely wild stuff went down. We got... So you completed all four of your Grand Trials, then go forth to the Pokemon League. We went ahead and caught ourselves a Solgaleo. He is not currently in the party, and I actually need to change something up real quick. I need to go grab someone out of our box. Uh, if you guys know who we're grabbing out of the box, be sure to comment that down below. Uh, before we, before I do that, be sure to do that. Hit pause and go ahead and do that. And um, why do I have? Oh, uh, this Skarmory came from uh, what's it called? Uh, Poke Pelago. That's where it came from. It just got added to the to the box. Uh, we need to go ahead and add Crab Brawler to the team. Why are you adding Crab Brawler, Cinco? Why? Why you haven't used Crab Brawler in so long? Well, he evolves while you are on Mount Lanakila, which is where we are heading, which is where the Pokemon League is, and uh, he evolves by leveling up on Mount Lanakila, which is, uh, like I already said, I'm just rambling at this point. Uh, we're heading up Mount Lanakila, make our way to the Pokemon League, and what do we have here? Alright, there's no, no items or nothing, and we have a elevator, maybe? It looks like an elevator. Oh, we got Gladian coming down the elevator, okay. I've been waiting for you to thank you for what you did for Lily, for our mother. I appreciate it, maybe more than you know. And the only thing I can offer you in thanks is a great battle, so I'm going to show you my full power, my real full power this time, with the Z-Ring that Old Man gave me. Okay, so uh, we're going to start off this episode with a battle with Gladian. Uh, pretty exciting pretty exciting stuff going on. Pokemon Trainer Gladian. So what does he have? He has a Crobat. All right, last time we fought him, he had a Golbat. And we send out our Mimikyu. That is not too good for us. Definitely not too good. And it's hailing up here on Mount Lanakila. Uh, so we're gonna sh uh, Schwarge Dance, Cross Poison. That's that's gonna that's gonna. Oh, I always forget about Disguise. Oh my goodness, I always forget about Disguise. But that Cross Poison will hurt next turn. Definitely, unless we kill this thing with a Shadow Sneak, which is what I am definitely going to go for. You're hurt by uh, Hail. We're hurt by Hail. Alright, so let's get on with it. Oh no. Oh no, I didn't mean to Swords Dance again. Oh well, we will be at plus four. Alright, we are now at plus four attack. Not what I meant to do, but hey. I just got a little thumb happy. A little trigger happy. Alright, this time... I'm actually going to click out Shadow Sneak, and hopefully this thing dies, because if not at plus four, that'd be ridiculous. Okay, thank you for dying, Crobat. Thank you for dying. All right, and out is probably going to come type Null, I'm assuming. Weavile. I didn't mean to keep battling. I am really just goofing all over the place, and it's got pressure, of course, and this thing is definitely going to outspeed us, so we need to go for Shadow Sneak. Uh, if you do not know, Weavile is super speedy, super, super speedy, and Night Slash, we're dead. Yep, Night Slash, we're dead. Okay, so this Gladian battle is, uh, it's def definitely difficult, definitely difficult. I guess we're gonna go into Feminist, because Weavile is a fire, or is a ice type, so we can kill it with fire. Kill it with fire! Yes, kill it 
with fire. Flamethrower, to be exact. Night Slash, not going to do a whole lot. Actually, that did a whole lot. <laughs> that did more than half. That is a clean two-hit KO. But Weavile's dead, so it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. Alright, who is next? Buffeted by the hail. That is fine. Silvali, no! That is crazy. His, um... His type null evolved into a Silvali. I wonder if he has a, a type change, whatever, uh, with that RKS system ability. Oh, it is a. I don't know what type that is. I think it's fighting type. I can't tell. Let us let us see. Let's see. We're gonna we're gonna go for the protect here and see what he does. Crush claw. Is that a steel type move? I really don't know. Well, by the by that color, it's. It's uh, maybe fire, maybe fighting. Uh, I guess we'll go for a fighting type move. Crush Claw. Oh my goodness. Okay, that did nothing. But he got the defense drop. And we missed. Oh my goodness. Why hakamo -O? Why hakamo -O? This thing is 10 levels above you and you ate up that hit. Can you please, please do some work here. Ble please, not please, please. Okay, so that was neutral, so maybe it is a fire type? And I dropped off Primarina so we could add, uh, what's his name? So we could add Crab Brawler. <sighs> Not the best idea. Not the best idea. We'll go out into Two Cannon. Two Cannon is our hard hitter. She punches hard and, and quite often. She punches hard and often. That was a crit, oh my goodness. And you got the defense drop. That is a talented, talented Silvali. Call the talent squad. Um, Beak Blast. Beak Blast should take this thing out. Beak Blast will take anything out. Multi-attack? Oh, goodness. Oh, we are blown away. Almost. Almost blown away. I still don't know what typing it is, but Beak Blast does take it out. I think it might be fire type. But it doesn't matter, because it's gone. It is one, and two cannons level 58. And Hakamo O levels up. I wonder what level this thing evolves. I feel like I looked it up at one point, but I don't remember. And a Lucario. Oh my goodness. Come on out, feminist. Come on out, feminist. All right, so he's got one Pokemon left. Just a little Lucario. He hasn't used a Z move yet. He said he was going to use a Z move at some point. Uh, flamethrower, we will flamethrower this thing and hopefully take it out. Probably not. Oh, we do! That is awesome. Good work, Feminist. Good work. And she gains a ton of experience. Gladian is like, <gasps> oh no! There's nothing more to say. And I got dollar bills. Cash money dollar bills. And it is still a Halen. It is still a Halen. You got good Pokemon. I know what kind of trainer you are now and what kind of journey you've been through. Lily wanted me to tell you something. She's looking after our mother at the foundation. She wanted me to tell you that you're the best Pokemon trainer in the world, Cinco. She gave me this for you. A Max Elixir. Okay, that'll come in handy in the Pokemon League. How's working hard to get stronger too? <clears throat> If you two are going to get even stronger, then I guess I can't let my guard down yet. You're right. I know we aren't friends, but we aren't enemies anymore either. That's true. That's definitely true. Keep winning. Maybe I'll see you again if you do. Alright, so uh, when I was saving my game last time, I went ahead and counted the Z-Crystals we have. I believe I counted 15, and there's 18 types. So we are still missing roughly 3 Z-Crystals. And I'm, I'm pretty sure Psychic is one of them. Uh, but I can't think of any of the others right off the top of my head. We're going to go ahead and heal up. Because, uh, you know, he, he did he did quite the job on us. He, he, he was putting in the absolute finest. That Silvali almost took us out. But now we are going to head up Mount Lanakila. Uh, I don't even know if there is going to be a... Um, uh, Victory Road, like in every other game. I have no idea. 
All right, come on, A. Press A. There we go. We're going to head up the mountain. There we go. Oh, we don't even get to watch. We don't even get to watch. Oh, here we are at the top. Hello. Hello, top of the mountain. T top of the mountain. Sorry, that was a bad pun. All right, let's see what we can get up here. What kind of wild Pokemon are we going to get on Mount Lanakila? An Alolan Vulpix. All right, okay, all right. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and run away from this thing for now. For now. Because we already have one. It is a good nature. So we're going to go ahead and stick with the Vulpix that we have right now. we got an escape rope. That could come in handy depending on what we are up against. Because I don't really know. You have no idea. Alright, what do we have here? Probably a... Oh, an Absol. Okay. I am not sad about an Absol. Uh, I'm not going to catch it, but I know I now know that we can catch Absol up here. Uh, because uh, in the post-game, you can get all of the... What's it called? Mega Stones. And, uh, yeah, and there's a Mega Absol. So, oh, we got a Zygarde cube cell thing. A Zygarde thingy, my bub. All right, we're going to keep on keeping on. No encounter there. And we're heading into a, uh, a little cavey area. All right. We have another encounter. Who are you and what do you want? Who are you and what do you want? A Sneasel. All right, that is, that is nice. That is nice. What is your ability? Is it pressure? No. I don't know what Sneasel's abilities are. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and run. Uh, I know we can catch Sneasel's up here because Weavile is super good. It's very fast, and uh, I like that. Uh, you might be seeing a Weavile in uh, some competitive stuff that we do here on the channel. And what is hiding over here? How do we... Oh, we got it. <laughs> I just barely missed it. We got the TM for Ice Beam. Okay. Is there anyone on our team that can learn Ice Beam right now? Because that is uh, that's pretty good. No one can learn Ice Beam. Update, guys. No one can learn Ice Beam. And we're going to head back on over here, but not before we get an encounter. Let me guess. A Sneasel? It's an Absol. Okay, so you can catch Absol inside as well. I assume you can probably catch Sneasel outside of the cave. Uh, we just didn't encounter one out there. It's level 45. These are some crazy high levels uh, for these wild Pokemon. I know we are much higher, but still. But still. Oh, actually, wait. Hold up. Wait a minute. Let me throw Hakamo. Oh, oh not Summary. Always do that. I always keep forgetting we need to push Y to go ahead and switch them. Go ahead and put Hakamo'o out front because uh, we got that fighting type move and all of these Pokemon are super weak to fighting. Uh, Sneasel, Absol, uh, what else was there? The Vulpix. All right, so here we have the Icy Rock uh, so we can evolve our Eevee. So uh, we can evolve our Eevee there and let us see what we got. Let us see what we got. By the way, guys, I have no idea. <gasps> a snow run DS, please come to me, snow run. Ever since, whenever this Pokemon was released, I feel like it was Gen Three. I have loved snow run. Absolutely in love with snow run. Oh my goodness! Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Or kill it. By the way, you can just go ahead and kill that thing. I don't really care. Uh, so we are not going to catch that snow run. We will come back. We will catch all of these Pokemon. I promise, and even if I don't do it on screen, you will definitely be seeing them in the future. Okay, so where are we now? Um, is there any items? No items. All right, let's head up this little bluff here. And what do we have? I kind of want to hop on Stoutland. I feel like there's got to be some items around here, but update, there's not. No items anywhere near here. And we have another elevator. I got a feeling there's something down there in that corner. Uh, because there's grass all the way there. We got another Sneasel. We'll take this thing out. We will level up with Hakamo'o. And maybe we'll evolve. Maybe we'll just evolve. Uh, actually, we're not even going to level up. So it doesn't matter. Go ahead, Sky Uppercut. It is four times effective. And you outspeed us. Wow, super speedy. That was a crit. This is a talented Sneasel right here. Super talented Sneasel. 
and my forehead is itching for some weird reason. All right, let's go ahead and see what is down here in this. Oh, we got an item. That's what I thought. Got a max revive. Definitely going to come in handy in the Pokemon League. And we will head on up the side of this mountain some more. All right, what do we have? What do we have? We got a PMC. And we got a guy with him a champ. Let's go ahead and speak to him. Used to be you could be a champion of the island challenge by clearing the seven trials. I'm exa I've exhausted all my strength coming this far. What a trying path it is we've chosen. Okay, yeah, cool, cool talk, guy. We're going to go ahead and heal up because we can. Might as well. We got a free PMC right here. Go ahead and talk to the person uh, over on the other side. And Nurse Joy, I love how she's like, oh, you're up late. Yeah, whopping 7.30. We're up super late. Alright, who are you? The battles here will be so fierce and difficult. Wait, are we at the Pokemon League right now? Is this it? And as you guys notice, we don't have a whole lot of money because I went ahead and stocked up on full restores at the end, uh, or uh, off screen. Uh, you know, just, just so I didn't have to do it on screen so we can... Oh, we got the move relearner here. Okay. And we definitely have heart scales, so let us see. Let's just go ahead and check check a look at two cannon. What can you relearn? What would I like to remember? I don't know. Ooh, let's go ahead and relearn pet, yes. Uh you know that that actually nope, nope, false. Do I wanna give up? I do wanna give up, because I'm a quitter. I am a super quitter. And who is over here? We've got, we got, uh, we got, uh, what's his name? The, the same sprite as the chief of the sea folk. And is, are we here? Are we here? Is it now? Professor Kukui called me up everyone, called up everyone who had ever passed all the trials or become an island challenge champion and summoned them here. He said, don't, don't want to see if you have what it takes to be called a world-class champ? Okay. Is, are we here? Is this now? Are we here and now? I have no... Oh, we got a PP Max. That is awesome. I believe we have two PP Maxes. I think we have a PP Up too. And we got another Zygarde Cell. Man, this Mount Lanakila is really doing us some good. <gasps> I think we are here. Oh my goodness, it's Hal. Cinco, wake up for me. I don't know what he said. So after we split up at Aether Paradise, I went and cleared all the rest of my trials, and then I went back home to train with Alima a bit. I was just thinking it was t time to take on the Pokemon League. Then, then I heard from Gladian that you were already heading here, Zinko, so I booked it here as fast as I could. That was like the fastest I've ever moved in my life, you know? That's not what I came here to tell you. Are you going to battle us? Zinko, we're going to decide which one of us will be the first of the Pokemon League. You're going to need to use your full force if you think you're going to beat me and my team when we're serious about winning. So yeah, we're battling how? Right now... It is happening. It is happening, actually. Oh, right. He has four Pokemon. He's got his Alolan Raichu. We still have no ground-type moves. Uh, so this is still not good for us. I want to get Earthquake. We need to go find Earthquake. We need to find Earthquake. I guess we'll go ahead and Dragon Claw, because that's what we've got. And Psychic is going to hurt and take us out because we are 10 levels below. I am sorry, Hakamo. Oh, that's saddening. Um, we're going to Decidueye and we will, uh, what's it called? What's that move? Uh, spark or Spirit Shackle, not Sparkling Shackle. Silly me. Spirit Shackle this Raichu. Psychic. Oh, man, it was a crit. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be a more difficult battle than uh, Gladian, it looks like. Please take it out. Thank you. You are putting in the finest right now, Decidueye. Thank you. You are the MVP, the most valuable Pokemon right now. Decidueye is level 56. All right, who do we have next? He's definitely got a Primarina, and he's got a Flareon as well. Uh, we don't have anything for this Flareon, but we do have Mimikyu, who resists. Uh, resist Flareon Stab, uh, which is good, but still doesn't make any sense to me. So come on out, Flareon. 
Yo, look at Flareon's tail. It is so poofy. Flareon's tail is so poofy. Oh, wait, no. He resists our stab. We don't resist his stab. I always get that messed up. I am dumb. Uh, that's not going to do anything. Does he take recoil from our disguise? Please take recoil. Okay, so it doesn't take recoil when it busts a disguise. Good to know. It's just a nice little thing to know. And I guess we're going to go for a Shadow Sneak. A Shadow Sneak. And that almost takes it out. But it's Flare Blitz. Hopefully the recoil will take this thing out. Oh my goodness. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. We almost got taken out by a Flareon. Almost. Maybe he was level 59. Look at this. Ooh. And Komala. Yo, where can we catch ourselves a Komala? I missed it. I missed it. And we don't have a fighting type move in sight because Komala is a uh, normal type little, ko little koala bear. Pretty cool. Uh, you should be probably seeing me use a Komala sometime in the near future. Uh, whether it is uh, Wi-Fi battles or anything of the sort. Uh, we are going to go ahead and Beak Blast. Sucker Punch. Okay, we ate that up. But Komala has a base 115 in attack. That is absolutely ridiculous. I mean, you look at that thing and you're like, probably not that strong. It has base 115 attack, which is crazy. It is crazy. And here comes Primarina. We've got something to answer, Primarina. We have what we like to call a Skill Link Adamant Bullet Seed. And that is what we like to call it. I mean, that's technically exactly what it's called. It's not what we like to call it. And that, look at the damage. Look at the damage. It's not even going to need all five hits. It is not even going to need all five hits. We'll take it out in four. There we go. Goodbye, Primarina. Goodbye, How You just got demolished. There we go. We just got another 8K. Another $8,000. Oh, and I really wanted my Pokemon to know how it feels to beat your team this time. But being seriously frustrated will only make me stronger. So you better go and become the champion, because I'm going to train so that next time I can come beat Champion Cinco. Good luck, cuz. And here. Three max revives. Oh my goodness. That is crazy. I'm really glad that the kid who moved here to Alola turned out to be you, Cinco. Well, yeah. I'm awesome. I am Flippin' amazing. I mean, I win every battle, and the only battle I don't win is when I only have two Pokemon. Alright, we're gonna go ahead, heal up. For some reason, our uh, Crab Brawler did not level up. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do that. We are going to go ahead and level up our Crab Brawler. We will get it all nice and evolved. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and actually throw him out front. Not going to leave him out front. We'll just switch train him uh, just so he can evolve because I don't know what it evolves into. And the only reason I know that it does evolve is uh, from the Pokedex page. And then I just went and looked it up. I don't remember what it was called or what type it was. But I know that it does evolve on Mount Wanakila. And down we go. We are going to head into the grass, get some encounters, get some levels. And, uh, and then we're going to take on the Pokemon League, guys. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. We are going to take on the Pokemon League already. I mean, it feels like it feels like we haven't been playing this game for like a week, even though it has been quite a long time. This is such an amazing game so far, and I can't wait to see what the post game is like. You know what? We're going to go ahead and uh, we're going to Z uh, all out pummeling. And he protects, so it doesn't even matter. No, we're still going to do the animation. That's no good. That was a good move. That was a that was a solid move on that snow runs part. Oh my goodness, snow run. The whole animation. Oh, it still hurts it. Hello? The wild snow went couldn't fully protect itself. 
ice body. Oh, it's hailing. Okay. And we get hurt by the hail as well. We're going to go ahead, power up punch. We should, ooh, frost breath. That is always a crit. Fun fact. Ooh, that really hurt. That really hurt. We're gonna we're gonna have to switch out. We're gonna have to switch out. Ice body gonna get that regeneration back. All right, come on, crab roller, come on back. I guess we'll just send out Mimikyu just because it, it'll kill whatever. And then hopefully within a couple minutes, our um, our crab roller shall evolve. Goodbye, disguise. Goodbye. This hail makes the battle go a whole heck of a lot longer with that ice body. With the ice body. The music in this game is absolutely fantastic. You guys need to go ahead, play the game, listen to the uh, the soundtrack of the game. It is phenomenal. All right, come on, give us, give us a something that will give us a lot of. Like, give us an Audino, a, a Blissey, a level one hundred Blissey. Give us a level one hundred Blissey, so we can uh, fight it, get all the experience, and switch out. We'll go out into Mimikyu, and uh, it'll break our disguise because whatever. And let's kind of protect, unless it's gonna protect like the last one did. If he plays on that thing, we're real. A crunch. Okay. Come on, Mimikyu. Do work. Can we take this thing out with a uh, with one Shadow Sneak? I hope so. And it protected. Never mind. We can't take it out with one Shadow Sneak because our one Shadow Sneak doesn't even work. Okay. Alright, come on, Shadow Sneak. Shadow Sneak. Come on, there we go, there we go, all right. Oh my goodness, how much more experience does Crab Roller need? He's getting like 800 per uh, Pokemon. He still needs, oh, 69, okay. So with just one more little baby Pokemon will take this thing up a level. It will literally take it up a notch. We will kick it up a notch. All right, we have an Absol. We have ourselves an Absol. All right, we're gonna switch out into Mimikyu. Sorry if these last few minutes of this episode are not the most exciting. Uh, after this battle, it will get super exciting. And then in the next episode, we are going to go ahead and take on the Elite Four. Oh my goodness, we're gonna take on the Elite Four. I can't believe we're already to this point in the game. All right, we'll go ahead and play play rough, not pray rough. Sucker punch, goodbye disguise. This disguise ability is kind of broken, kind of broken. I wonder if it like if it deflects a Z move as well. Like if you use a Z move on disguise, it just goes oh, it broke. And crab roller is level thirty two. Oh, look at this. Look at this, you know what's happening. What? Crab Roller's evolving? Here we go. What do you look like? What do you look like, Mr. Evolution? Please tell me. Please tell me. Whisper sweet nothings in my ear. Oh my goodness, your Crab Roller evolved into Crabominable. Oh my goodness, look at this. Are we gonna learn Ice Punch or something? We gotta go ahead and read this dex entry. Oh, look at that, it's so much bigger. Oh my goodness. Completed a page in the Pokedex. It aimed for the top, but got lost and ended up on a snowy mountain, being forced to endure the cold. This Pokemon evolved and grew for the Wooly Crab Pokemon fighting ice. I kind of assumed that. Are you gonna learn Ice Punch? Yep, Ice Punch, there we go. It should get like a signature move that's like Ice Punch, but better. Uh, we'll go ahead and get rid of Bubble Beam because that is uh, special and not Stab at all. All right, ta-da, Bubble Beam was forgot. We got Ice Punch. And that is a dope looking Pokemon. We're gonna go ahead and check out its stats. 
go ahead and check out its statistics. All right, we have 110 in attack. Its speed is abysmal. Oh my goodness! And we have, oh, this thing is hyper cutter. I could have sworn we had Iron Fist on this thing. Uh, if I ever plan on using a Crab Abominable, which I don't think I will, but you know what? Hey, if you guys want it, I will do it uh, in the future. I will need to get one with Iron Fist because I am not looking to run Hyper Cutter. Uh, it is good to run for those Intimidate teams, but Hyper or, uh, Iron Fist would be better with because we're punching Pokemon. Uh, power up, punch, ice punch, etc. So now we're going to heal up, and while that is going on, I'm going to wrap this episode up here today, guys. Go ahead and smash those thumbs up down below and show a little love to that sub button down below so you don't miss out on any more content. And I'm going to get out of here, guys. Peace.